Hey, uh, hi. Today is uh, 7th of March. Uh, we're celebrating Holi in India. I just found some time to uh, work on my motorcycle. Uh, it hasn't been able to run properly. I own a Royal Enfield Machismo 500. It hasn't been able to run properly. I couldn't figure out what the problem was. I thought there was dust getting into the carburetor. And that is why, you know, the carburetor used to get blocked. And it, it then used to fire well. Now, finally today, I figured out what was the problem. And I'll just quickly show you, uh, you know, what I, f you know, found out. So here it is. Uh, this is my tank. Yeah. This is my tank here. Yeah. Royal Enfield. This is supposed to be a genuine tank. You know, a genuine spare part from Royal Enfield. But unfortunately, the problem with these spare parts is they rust very easily. And I don't know why. This is like my second tank now. You know, I've been using uh, Royal Enfield since 2008. And uh, I'm on my second tank. and. You know, it's really very sad that you know Royal Enfield is not able to deliver quality parts, you know, on its motorcycle. At least on the old ones. I don't know about the latest, you know, uh, Royal Enfield uh, motorcycles. But yeah, as you can see here, this is what I found. You see this? This is all rust, and that is what was blocking my carburetor every time I start, you know, tried run my motorcycle that's my motorcycle in the back there you know it's a Royal Enfield Machishma 500 so yeah let's see uh, I'll try to clean up my tank I'll try to dry it up before I you know try using it again and uh, hoping for the best right meanwhile I would really request uh, Royal Enfield to look into such matters you know it's a very common problem and trust me, it's coming from a guy who's been using a motorcycle for a long time now. And I really wish, you know, uh, they really work on it. So, because my second uh, preference would never be a Royal Enfield unless they really work on their spare parts. Alright, thank you for watching the video. I'll see you guys.